Alright, welcome back, warriors, to another episode of Bloodlines. Today is our Scooby-Doo episode. We're going to a haunted hotel. Ooh. Uh, to obtain a personal item to exercise a ghost. So it's part uh, Scooby-Doo and part uh, Exorcist today. Uh, okay, let's see here. Up in the top left, uh, saying the Ocean House Hotel is up there. And I'm down at the bottom left. So I should be able to take a right and then a left and get there. So down this way, we'll try to snack on some rats along the way just in case we have a combat scenario. Well, it doesn't look like I'm going to get to eat some rats. We're already here. Yep. Yeah, I don't know what good a bat's going to do against a bunch of ghosts, but um, we'll find out if it's effective at all. Loading, loading, loading. Load them up. Okay. It's very spooky. Ooh, nice job with the music. It's really setting the mood. Yeah, as a kid I grew up watching Tales from the Crypt, so I love this kind of dark theme to the game. Watched uh, B-movies non-stop in high school, too. Hmm. I don't know if there's any point to sneaking. I guess there is. I hope I'm not seen right away. Let's uh, run around here and see if there's an alternate entrance, possibly. A more stealthy approach. More uh, Metal, Metal Gear Solid approach to this, possibly. I don't see one, though, so I'm going to head straight in. Oh, God. <laughs> nice. That was a nice touch. Well, this is locked. What what if you don't have um, the lock picking ability? There's got to be another way to get in then. Who's over here in this building? Huh. Let's uh, check this out. Do some investigation here. What is this stuff? What is going on here? Oh no, they're not. That's the Tesla coil, isn't it? Can I turn it on? So they're going for the kind of Dr. Frankenstein thing here? What is, what is this, though? Okay. I don't know. Ah, a key. Whoa. Things are going bump in the night here, folks. I'm sufficiently creeped out. Can I get in this computer? So that's how you get in without the log picking skill. Alright. Something hit the window just as I picked up that key. That was creepy. <laughs> this is going to be good, I can tell already. Alright. Uh. <laughs> I'm scared. Oh, goodness.
Uh. Things are rattling. Lights are strobing. Oh god. Oh, don't tell me the... Uh, no crying children, please. No laughing or crying children. What was that? Oh, jeez. Huh. Some, uh... Old black and white photos. Take a look at these. Nice beard, man. You too. Wow. Alright. So what exactly do we need to do? Uh, personal item. Okay. So just get a personal item. Uh oh. Whoa. It's very, uh... Poltergeisty. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> this is good. This is nice. Okay, elevator. I'm not done. I can't go in that elevator anyway. Let's check out this room over here. Oh dear goodness. This is, uh... Ouch! That hurt! Uh, this reminds me of Clyde Barker's Undying. That game is really atmospheric and really creepy. If you like first-person shooters and horror games, you've got to check that one out. You've got to. He's watching. He's watching. Oh, God. Alright, you. You're going down eventually. I don't know how I'm going to kill you. Since you're a ghost and all I have is a baseball bat, but uh, I'm going to figure it out. All these faces are going to explode, aren't they? Yes. Back up so they don't hit me. Am I stuck? Oh no. 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 Don't do this game. Don't do this game. Yeah, I'm gonna have to reload, I guess, because I'm stuck. Load. Auto save. Alright. Okay. Let's just head straight upstairs this time. And uh, ignore all of the stuff going bump in the night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen it all before. And let's not get stuck on the darn chandelier this time. Avoid that thing like the plague. No, stay away from me, chandelier. Stay away from me. You don't want to explode. Yeah, yeah. Need a personal item. Well, you know it's gonna be upstairs. Probably gonna be in the deepest part of the. Oh my God! The house swallowed me. <laughs> Shit! Oh my God. Okay, I do have an infravision with this protean, I believe, so I can see. All right. Let's get the heck out of here. Let's equip the baseball bat just in case. Can I go through here? Let's lockpick this and see what happens. Mm, I really should have uh, drank some blood before I came here. If I'm gonna use... Whoa! Creepy ghost. Oh my goodness. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? 
Oh no, music. What's this laying, laying here? Stop it. Oh no, no! Don't throw stuff at me. Okay. There's nothing else in here, really. Don't believe. Nope. I've been locked in! Are you kidding me? I can't get out. This is really good. Very nice, uh, fun little area here. Let's see. What's this over here? Ah, uh, smash it. Yeah. Cannot see a darn thing, but that's the way it's supposed to be. Sorry, guys. Uh, let's lockpick our way out of here. Nope, failed. Well, if you can't lockpick and you get stuck in here, how are you supposed to find your way out? Exactly. There's got to be a key somewhere, right? There must be. Or some alternate route out of here. Let's go back through here, I guess. Any other holes in the wall? I guess if you're stuck in here without a decent lockpick ability, you're screwed. Got buff though. Where's the door now? <laughs> Can't see a thing. Oh, here it is. And blood buff's gonna run out. Ah, oh, still failed. Oh, goodness. I can't see a darn... Oh, 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 I saw something highlighted. There we go. Hotel Hell. There's a movie called Motel Hell. It's a pretty fun little movie. Child's severed head found in hotel laundry room. Oh, my. Hmm. Oh, okay, you have to do something to move along. I see they're building up a story here. First floor, second floor, third floor, elevator, basement. Can I use the elevator? Please? Please? Hmm. There must be something to do in here. Oh, there's 15 minutes. Gonna have to continue our exploration of the Haunted Hotel next episode. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time, boyers. Later.